high fans of high quality entertainment. He's always cold. I turned the heat up. Anyway, once again, uh, I have two stacks with 12 CDs in each stack, and you, the viewer, gets to choose. And you're not even thrown in jail or anything, but you, you'll be one year without any other music except for either stack one or stack two. Let's just have some fun. You don't have to go to jail unless you want to. And also, I now have 19 members on my Patreon channel. So if I get a 20th member today, I will do, in, my, in an upcoming YouTube video on this channel, I'll do a, an upcoming uh, little song or something, or I'll sing your name, or, or I'll do something silly with my guitar. And you're guaranteed a song request. Whatever song you, you request, I'll check it out on Patreon. So, two stacks. Every time I do this, it's always, I think, more stack two than stack one. This time, I just want to make it a little more close. So, really think it over before you choose which stack. These are fun to do because usually there's, you know, favorite artists that you like in, in both stacks. And even with me right now, I have no idea which stack I would choose. I'll decide at the end. So, stack number one. Just imagine you're in jail for a year. That, that just adds to it. And you can only listen to these CDs or that stack of CDs. Oh, and just to make it a bit more fun this time, not, not every time, but this time, you may exchange one CD from one of the stacks for a, a CD that you prefer in the other stack, but just one. So stack number one contains Rolling Stones. Let it bleed, let it bleed, let it bleed, let it bleed. Black Sabbath. Sabbath, bloody Sabbath. Actually, my only favorite album by this band. And I bought it when it came out back in 1974. I was so hip back in the day. Kiss, their debut album. And speaking of debut albums, <laughs> their, their only album, and definitely one of my favorite albums of all time, with Eric Clapton and Ginger Baker and Steve Winwood and Rick Gretsch, Blind Faith. One of my favorite 70s bands, early 70s bands, Humble Pie with Steve Mario Watt. I, I can't say his name, forget it. Steve Merowette, is that how you say it? And uh, Peter Frampton. Tool, Undertow. Yeah, you're gonna juice stack one, I know. Velvet Underground, White Light, White Heat. The Who, Odds and Sods, and this is the expanded version on CD, Aren't You Lucky? And I actually played this for the first time in years the other night, and it is just so good. So many really good songs like uh, Long Live Rock, Postcard, uh, the studio version of Young Man Blues, Little Billy, Now I'm a Farmer, Water, Naked Eye. Procol Harum with uh, Robin Trower on guitar. Pretenders, their debut album. One of the greatest debut albums ever. 
And the two double CDs, just like in stack number two, are Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers' Greatest Hits, all kinds of great music, and speaking of Eric Clapton and Ginger Baker, Cream Gold. And it's basically, I think it's, I think it's almost all of their studio albums and their their the Cream Live album and I think possibly the second part of that. I don't know. I'll have to Google it later. So that is stack one. Stack two. On one CD. The Bee Gees, Timeless, All-Time Greatest Hits. So that includes the, their 60s songs and, of course, the... I don't necessarily call it disco years, but that's what people call it. It's way better than disco. I started a joke. I started a joke. Which started the whole world crying. Something like that. I don't know the words. I just know the title. That's the words I know of the song. Something Canadian, eh? The Guess Who? Share the Land. Lou Reed, New York. Something Canadian again. I didn't do it on purpose, honest. Clatu with their excellent debut album, 347 Eastern Standard Time. What? Sing the song? No. No. Calling occupants of inter... <laughs> Calling occupants of interplanetary craft. That's it. <laughs> uh. Ramones, Rocket to Russia. Blue Oyster Cult, their finest album, I believe, or one of their finest, Secret Treaties. Sparks, for all you Sparks fans out there, a woofer in Tweeter's clothing. Once again, an, uh, an album I was listening to the other night, and I hadn't played it in a long time. And it's, this album is remixed by Stephen Wilson, just like he did with some of the Yes albums, and it is so good. XTC Black Sea. Frank Zappa and the Mothers of Invention. We're only in it for the money. Once again, another band I don't play as much as I should. I played this last night and so good. 10CC, the original soundtrack. I got the love, so don't forget it. It's just the crazy phase I'm going through. I'm in love. Something's, uh, you know, this is the kind of album that people either, oh, I hate this band, or they love them. It's a hater, it's a hater love band. And I, I really love this album. Their new one that came out, uh, I've heard it, and it's just too poppy for me. But this one I like, Smashing Pumpkins. I can't say the title, it's so long. Shiny and... Oh So Bright, Volume 1, EP, No Past, No Future, No Sum. It's an EP, but it's basically an album. There's eight songs on it. And the two doubles are Led a Zeppelin, Physical Graffiti, and The Kinks, Greatest Hits, The Essential Kinks. Oh, which one? So, the, the stack two. Okay, the Bee Gees. I love the Bee, Bee Gees, but I mean, I could go a year without listening to them. The Guess Who are great. Lou Reed, New York. 
Platt 2, 347. Ramones, Bluester Cult, Sparks, XTC, Frank Zappa and the Mothers of Invention, 10CC, Smashing Pumpkins. Oh, I hate that band. <laughs> Led Zeppelin, Physical Graffiti, and the Kinks. That's a good stack. And what stack one again? I'll tell you. Cream, that'd be cool to listen to. Tom Petty's great. Pretenders, Procol Harum, The Who, oh, The Velvet Underground, White Lightweight Heat, Tool Under, do I haven't listened to this enough? Humble Pie, oh, Blind Faith, Kiss I Can Take Her Lead, Black Sabbath, that's great, and Let It Bleed. Just like everybody else, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take stack two. <laughs> I, I hope I made those kind of even. I think I did, because I, I put two CDs down for each in each stack, and I kind of compare them, and so I kind of hopefully make it evened out. But I mean, physical graffiti, Lou Reed's New York, Clatu, Secret Treaties, Sparks, of course, Next TC. Mothers of Invention. Yeah, Physical Graffiti mm -hmm. and the Kinks. It's like, yeah, I'm taking Stack 2. It'd be, may, maybe it'll be all Stack 2. I don't know. But hopefully some of you decided to take Stack 2. Or I mean, sorry, Stack 1. I'm all confused. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to check out my Patreon channel. I've got over like 25 videos there already. And go there, become a member, and make a song or even an album request. Later today, I'm, I think I'm going to be doing, uh, well, some song requests there, but also listening to uh, John and Yoko's Two Virgins for the first time all the way through. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Say bye, Bernie.